Swift F1 performs all fiber termination and splice processes of stripping, cleaning, cleaving, and splicing in one unit. A Swift F1 unit allows convenient and fast insulation work at all terrain conditions, on flat ground, on a power pole, in a bucket truck, and in a manhole. Now let's take a look at the Swift F1. Stripper Unit Swift F1's automatic thermal stripper leaves minimum damage to optical fiber in stripping process. Over 1 million cycle motor life is guaranteed. Fiber Cleaning Unit Cleaning alcohol will be dispensed when pushed down. Cleaning alcohol is refilled. Cleaver Unit High quality single action cleaving is guaranteed by adoption of oil damper system. Life of the blade is over 50,000 cycles. Put fiber chips into chip collector after cleaving. Splicer Unit As Swift F1 adopts V-Groove alignment, keeping V-Groove clean and cleaning fiber are most important factors for best splice result. Sleeve Heater Unit Clamp assembly on right side and block on left side can be selected and assembled according to cable and connector type. Batteries Two batteries are used. Over 120 cycles can be performed with the two batteries in Swift F1. Batteries can be charged using battery charger and battery level can be checked. Work table Work table can be worn easily by fastening and is designed for easy field work and all terrains like manhole, power hole and bucket truck. Swift F1 is a patented all-in-one unit performing all fiber termination and splice process of stripping, cleaning, cleaving and splicing in one unit. Now demonstration of splice on connector assembly using Swift F1. Now indoor cable and splice on connector is connected. Boot and heat shrink tube are inserted onto the cable. Boot goes in first and then the tube follows. After stripping indoor cable for about 3 centimeters using jacket stripper, place the cable onto a holder. Place ferrule unit to a holder. Place the ferrule unit with the colored side facing up. Now we are ready to proceed. First, indoor cable is stripped. Close the cover on holder side first and then close the cover on stripper side. Motorized unit will automatically strip the cable within 1.5 seconds. Remove the holder opening the cover at holder side. Holder unit will automatically return to ready position when the cover at stripper unit side is closed. A brush include in the Swift F1 kit should be used for auto stripper blade cleaning to minimize any small damage to fiber. Any small fiber waste can cause a crack to the fiber during stripping process. Fiber should be cleaned thoroughly. Cleaning is very important. Especially the 10 millimeters from the jacket is most important. Recommended cleaning wipe should be used for cleaning. Do not use ordinary tissues. Results in dust on V-Groove. After cleaning, the fiber is cleaved. The fiber chip should be disposed into the attached chip collector for prevention of any danger. Fiber chips are put into the chip collector. An error can be happened during fiber alignment process if V-Groove and fiber is not clean. A brush include in the Swift F1 kit should be used for V-Groove cleaning. When a sticky foreign substance is on V-Groove, use fiber end to clean V-Groove. Place holder to left side of Swift F1.
strip fiber. Clean the fiber. Cleaning is very important. Continue to cleave the fiber. Place on right side of Swift F1. Check visually whether the fiber is well placed on the V-groove. After cleaning electric discharge and fiber alignment, the cleave angle is displayed. Estimated splice loss is displayed after splicing. Opening cover will initiate automatic tensile test, and tensile power is 2 Newton. Open fiber older covers of both sides. Hold indoor cable with left hand, and slowly take out ferrule part with right hand index finger supporting under ferrule cap. Do not hold the ferrule cap with fingers when taking out from the holder as the fiber can be broken. Ferrule cap should be placed on the finger, not held. Then hold the cable vertically and slowly slide down the heat shrink tube so that the flange on the ferrule part is inserted into the tube. Make sure the correct position of the metal member in the heat shrink tube. Place ferrule part to the heat oven with the red dot facing front and close the cover. Push heater button to start heating. Do not run heating operation more than once. Must set proper heating time. Take out heat sleeve ferrule part and assemble with boot assembly. Assemble housing. Finished. Once again, cleaning of the fiber and the V-groove of Swift F1 is very important. Also, when taking out splice cable and ferrule part from holders, Hold the cable with left hand and the right index finger should simply support the ferrule cap. We will repeat the process fast. After placing on holders, all the processes are finished within 1 minute and 30 seconds. Now we will do 0.9 millimeters.